Welcome to Thursday Oil Days. So I was challenged by my doTERRA people to um, tell my before, before oils and after, like my life before and after and what's changed. So my story relies heavily on my son's autism diagnosis. And I don't know that I want to talk about that because he is nine years old now. He's very self-aware. He doesn't like to be singled out and talked about. So I'm going to invite both my boys, my two big boys, <laughs> probably not my toddler. My two big boys, we're gonna talk about some oils that have changed our lives for the better. Okay, so this is my big boy, LJ. Actually, um, we're in cowboy hats because uh, we're going to Country Fest this weekend. <laughs> Actually, let me tell you about this hat. <laughs> this little yellow hat. So he has to do everything his big brothers do, and they didn't have a third cowboy hat. They had this women's vintage yellow felt hat, which is actually really cool, but <laughs> he thinks it's a cowboy hat, so if that's his cowboy hat. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to Country Fest, so we got cowboy hats. All right, let's get into the oils, huh, boys? Yeah. Okay. So, Sully, let's do Sully first. Sully, what? tell us about cheer oil and why you like it. Does it, it... It cheers me up when I cry. It makes you happy? Oh, good. You want to put some on? Go ahead. <laughs> Show us how you do it. <laughs> All right. That's probably enough. Just you need a little bit. That's probably plenty. And then you just rub it in. And you like how it smells? I right. smell it. So, sheer oil is Sally's pick. I don't know if it actually makes him happy or if it makes him think he's happy. But either way, it works. <laughs> All right, Sally, you're done. Thank you. Good job. LJ, you're up next. So, <laughs> LJ is going to talk about Digest Zen today. So when do you when do we put this oil on you? That's because if I parsec, you put this on. I I feel much better and excited like a firework. So if you're you, you just said if you're feeling carsick, we put this on your tummy <laughs> and you feel much better. Hey Sally, just a second. It's LJ's turn. Okay. Do you want to try again? When do we use this on you? Uh, by rubbing it on my tummy. Yeah, we probably don't need to show your tummy in the video. But when he is feeling car sick, we'll, we'll rub this on his tummy in the car and he feels much better, right? And then there's the other one that we use on LJ quite a bit. This one is breathe, and we use this right before you fall asleep. Remember that one? You smell it? Where do we put that one? Right here? Yeah, right before he falls asleep. So sometimes LJ gets a little bit of sleep apnea. That's probably plenty, you don't need that much. And that really opens up his airways before he falls asleep. You like that smell? And then here's one more that we use on LJ. So LJ is very allergic to mosquitoes. What are you allergic to? Um, Mosquitoes. I, I gotta tell you something that everything, uh, uh, another thing I'm allergic to. What's that? Squirrels. Squirrels? What? <laughs> that's because I hate Sandy from SpongeBob SquarePants. I hate him. That's not very nice. I know. Um, we don't hate Sandy from SpongeBob SquarePants, okay? I know. Okay. That's because she's nice. <clears throat> Anyways, he's allergic to cats. He's allergic to mosquitoes. No, 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 no. I'm not allergic to cats. Just a little bit. A little bit of denial. <laughs> I'm just a little bit allergic. Okay. Anyways, but you're really allergic to mosquitoes, right? When you get a mosquito bite, your bites get very, very big, like this big. Oh my god! Yeah, remember we would have to go to the doctor when you get mosquito bites? So we rub this oil on you, this blend. Lemon, lavender, and peppermint. And basically, pretend you got bit by a mosquito right on your arm. This is all we do. Rub it in. And it takes the swelling away, it takes the itch away, and yeah. 
This is our like staple allergy I'm blend. I'm allergic to moles. To moles? When have you ever been around a mole? Boys. I've been around a mole a long, long time ago. Let me tell you an oil that I use for my littlest day. Hey! <laughs> nice cowboy hat, man. Oh, we well, we'll probably should take the tags off, huh? <laughs> Me too! I think your tag is off. Is it? Oh, I guess it's not. Okay, we'll take these tags off. So, this guy, I do use this allergy blend for mosquito bites as well. He's not allergic, but it helps take away the itch. I also use tea tree for, like, slivers, cuts and scrapes. It's, a, it's like a natural antiseptic. So yeah, those are some of our oils that we use all the time. Before oils, we were at the drugstore and we were at the doctor's office often getting some antibiotics for mosquito bites. We were picking up all kinds of uh, critters, critters from, from the drugstore. Probably not. There's basically, this, this is just plants. Plant medicine is filling our medicine cabinet, and I feel confident and happy that these oils work. Okay, Sally, you want to come back here and say goodbye? Wow. All right, LJ, say goodbye. See you soon! That's, that's probably a little bit too, too loud. Can you do a regular voice? Goodbye. See you soon, bruh. <laughs> you, you say see ya, see ya soon, lady. Yes. So, oh, one thing, one more thing I want to say is mm -hmm. I never force my kids to do oils. Like, there's one oil that he doesn't like that I really want him to use, and that's deep blue. Mm -hmm. It's a little strong. For him. <laughs> so, I do not like deep blue. He has groin pains, and I would love to use deep blue on him because it would soothe the pain, but he says it's too strong. It so, okay. So I don't make him use it. I use oils on them that they get comfortable using. Okay. I don't know how I don't know if this video went well or not. <laughs> but I'm gonna upload it because Two. I told them what I use on the. What was it? All right, I use I use a few things on the. All right, I'm gonna end the video. And I don't. See you soon, bruh. What? Where? Where is that coming from? See you soon, bruh. <laughs> See you soon. See you soon, everybody. There. Thank you. Yeah, everything the big boys do, little guy has to do. So he's yelling at the top of his lungs. This guy's got to yell at the top of his lungs. <laughs> see us, see us soon, old lady. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Who are you calling old lady? I'm young. I'm young. <laughs> I feel young. <laughs> All right. Bye, everyone. I hope maybe this um, gave you a little insight into the oils that we use. Oh, see you later.